I wanted to say goodbye to you, to my old life, to the old me. I wanted to start over again. But starting over requires a full review of the past. And to review the past, you have to remember it. I've forgotten so much of my life. So much that I do seems so inconsequential that it doesn't even register in my memory. It falls to the wayside with all other sorts of trivial and mundane. But when I look back, all of those tiny little nothings forgotten have left a gaping maw. It seems nothing is truly inconsequential. I need it all so I know what it is I have to burn to the ground to start new. And as I start to remember, I realize that perhaps I've been here before, saying goodbye to the same person. But I think this time, it's heartfelt. A goodbye is always felt in the heart, but not always heartfelt. This goodbye, I'll feel. It's a goodbye to me. A goodbye to old ways, pains, and bad habits. A horse will always buck. A snake will always strike. A lion will always roar. And an eagle will always fly. My mind is clear, so why do I hide the truth? I can see well, so why do I try not to look too closely? I'm sturdy, so why don't I resist? And my will is strong, so why don't I create more change? Kindness. The path to freedom is lined with those who chose kindness. There's a strong possibility that subjugation, passive or aggressive, awaits all who choose the side of patience and civility. If the hand that feeds you also hits you, could you choose to starve? If authority wants you either subservient or subdued, could you risk life and limb for your freedom? If the one who claims to love you also hurts you, could you instead love yourself? Would you allow it to get to that point before you stood mighty and tall? The path to happiness is lined with those who had it in their grasp, but were afraid of grabbing too hard, afraid of their own strength. All who suffer, suffer because they're too weak to overcome. This is no indictment of one's personal character. Some were legitimately dealt the worst of bad hands. Some fought as well as anyone could. And others just didn't know what game was being played. Nuances aside, this world favors those best fit for its current shape in all walks of life. A heartfelt goodbye is given to the me who spared the hearts of so many undeserving in order to hold on to an ideology fit for saints and martyrs. With a clear mind, I'll aid the deserving and strongly judge the undeserving. With clarity of vision, I'll look closely at the hearts and minds of those I meet and deeply into the heart of matters at hand. With a sturdiness of constitution, I'll protect those I love and take all that I need in order to do so. With a will that only moves forward, I'll create a sure path, one step at a time. When all has been taken care of and I've said my goodbyes, perhaps the past will not have been in vain. Only then can I truly move forward. Thanks for watching the video. I'll be reading and analyzing my book from then till now on Wednesdays and peace of mind and vibrations on Saturdays. If you enjoyed this video, don't be afraid to like and subscribe so you can visit my channel each time I provide more content and engage in the comments so you can share your thoughts with me. Have a good day.